Yeah, I'm DJ Fat Tony. Can, 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 can I yeah, stop on. you? Is this about you or about me? Oh, is, is this about interview? me talking about Prince, talking about you? So shut up. And this is Fashion Radio. This week's guest, we are privileged to have in the house the amazing Paloma Faith. I'm Ro Bogdoff. Oh, Martine okay. Rose, the incredible Val Garland. What gets your creative juices flowing? The fool does it. It's amazing. That's my favorite question. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> that song was my sexual awakening. What do I say? Incredibly joyous. I'll to keep have going. Keep Kristen. going. Kristen. Like, it's Nick Knight. I'm not going to survive this. Well, I'm so happy to be here, darling. One of my best friends, Sam McKnight. Cora Corey. Best music video in terms of fashion. Nick. Madonna in latex. So this little story about one of our first meetings with Gaga. Most important song you've ever heard at a catwalk show. I mean, this is really vain because it's my own. I did a Versace show and Prince did the soundtrack. What's that one track from your childhood that influenced you and your personal style? That was easy. David Bowie, Life on Mars. Marilyn Monroe singing Diamonds Are a Girl's Best Friend. Throughout my childhood, I was obsessed with Britney Spears. <laughs> it with really her. annoys me when people say my childhood, I was obsessed by Britney, because I think that was like my mid-40s. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> they went hand in hand. Music drove that fashion. That's what drew me into fashion, was the music. Ding dong. You know, it's like trying to understand fashion without music is a really big you, one. You can't. 